So what in the world is a kuskuna? <laughs> Hey there, it's Teddy coming to you from the Vinyl Vault with another edition of Notes from the Vault. So before the current wave of vinyl reissuers and even before labels like Classic Records and Analog Productions began, there were very few reissue labels that had a focus on quality vinyl releases, as it should be. So for this video, I wanna focus on one of those early labels Mosaic Records and their diligent pursuit of quality and completeness. Now, I mention this because the Vinyl Vault uh, recently took in a collection that included a small but handsome selection from this label. So in the early 1980s, jazz writer, radio DJ, and record producer Michael Kuskuna along with the head of Blue Note Records Marketing, Charlie Lurie created a mail-order-only jazz label that focused on limited edition box sets that dove into the complete catalogs of individual artists, groups, or even recording sessions. I mean, some of jazz's most renowned artists have gotten the mosaic treatment, along with lesser-known masters. Michael Kuskuna in particular became a master archaeologist, digging through tape archives to unearth the best sources for Mosaic's over 200 releases. Now from the get-go, they focused on quality by creating very detailed booklets that just dove deeply into the artists, the sessions, everything surrounding what is included in each set. Just very, very cool. Of course, in the background, they're keeping a watchful eye on the mastering and pressing processes. By matching the right engineers for each job and utilizing the likes of RTI for plating and pressing. Early on, they mailed out brochures like this one with an order form included. And of course, later that morphed into direct online sales. These editions were limited in a couple of ways, either by a cap placed on the number of copies pressed or a finite amount of time that Mosaic was allowed to sell these box sets. The first 80 or so releases uh, were offered as both LP and CD sets, but after that, uh, vinyl releases became the exception, not the rule as CDs ruled the roost, but there were a few LP offerings uh, that were peppered in. So let me step back and show you what we currently have available of these wonderful sets. With the resurgence of vinyl and the fact that previous owners of these quality sets generally handled them with great care, along with the limited nature of their releases, these Mosaic LP sets have become incredibly collectible and desirable. If you would like to check any of these out in greater detail, 
please go to AcousticSounds.com. And from all of us here at Acoustic Sounds, we want you to be safe, get well, and enjoy the music. <laughs>